Ebony Tutorials, Advanced Prestige Building. Henry speaking. And now you are a 200,000 prestige player or higher. And you're wondering how to get more prestige. Well, I'm going to show you some techniques, tactics, and ways that you can improve your prestige once you're this high. First off, I'm going to show you this little toolbar that I now use. It's pretty handy. It's got a bunch of references here. Calculators, combat, items, everything is in here. Reference, social network, get a social network, a blog. All my videos are in here, easy to access. Oh no, I forgot how to take a level 10 barbarian. Combat. Barbarian. <laughs> Top ebony sites. There's ebony there. Ebony servers. If you want to pick a server actually let's do that they have some new updates I'll show you some of them explain a couple new tab here Ebony this is an email notifier emails you when a new server comes out so if you completely screwed up your account and you're really bad you want to start new and be the top dog of your server subscribe to this and then just wait till they email you and start out start new all right, stupid Internet Explorer. Okay, let's just pick a server here. This shows the server screen that you can always use. Just you'll see. To download this toolbar, just you can go to ebonytoolbar.com. The link is to the right, to the right, but underneath in the description. It's a handy toolbar. I recommend downloading it, especially if you're a serious player. All right, here we go. New patches since August 22nd. A new package. This is interest. This is good. Resources. They give you a lot more for your town hall and resource fields instead of getting 2,000 or 20,000 or 40,000. I think it was of wheat and stuff. They give you now like 200,000 or 400,000 or something like that. It's a lot better. They got smart there. This. Penicillin has been changed from cure to penicillin for clarity. Um, if attacker does not destroy 10% of the defender's troops, the attacker will not receive information on the troops and fortifications in battle report. Basically, people would send little amounts of troops just to get a scout report on people who have massive amounts of scouts. Now this will not work unless you can kill a bunch of their army. Just a little bug fix there. All right, back to the tactics. First off, build armies, and it's a good strategy to build warriors because they're cheap. They take really they're fast. You can build them a lot. I'd build a ton of warriors and just use them to attack high level valleys, level tens and stuff, or higher level barbarians or anything. Because when you lose warriors, you want to lose them because then you gain prestige. You don't want to lose all of them, but you want to win and have losses because then you gain a lot of prestige that way. Also. Another way I do it is I go into my walls, click the destroy button, and then you can destroy a certain amount. If you have all your spaces filled up, this is because you should be level 200,000 or higher, preferably around 300,000 to do these tactics. Delete some and then build some more because everything you build, you get more prestige. So you just build some more and you'll get more prestige soon. You can do that in all your cities. Oh, there goes all my okay. Farm high level NPCs will get you prestige like seven, eight, nine, and tens. Also as much as you can when you're a high level player, three hundred fifty thousand prestige and have a ton of archers. I try and take as many level ten barbarians as you can. Um raging battles constantly going. If you in wars and stuff and always killing people that's good too and well there you have it that's tactics for all your gaining prestige needs advanced thank you very much